This is everything that they fished with. Since he was a boy, John Faust's life has centered on fly fishing. But it was his role in a movie that created an explosion in Montana's fly fishing industry. I started tying flies for Bob Ward when I was nine years old. Uh, I started actually tying my own flies when I was six or seven. Over the years, Faust has been a guide, owned a fly shop, invented many fly patterns, manufactured his own fly tying tools, and tied thousands and thousands of flies. A career that has shaped and touched many anglers in the Bitterroot Valley and beyond. I wouldn't say I was a fly fishing legend. I catch my share of fish. I'm probably better known in the fly tying industry than I am in the fishing business. One of Faust's biggest achievements came in 1992 when he created a robotic fish that ate Brad Pitt's fly and triggered a boom to Montana's fly fishing industry. All I did is make that fish come up and eat that fly. See, the bug was hooked to the screen with another line, and then when the fish was pulled with a lanyard and came up and went down, the fly was pulled underwater, so it looked like the fish ate the fly. Today, Faust has collected and put into displays many fly fishing artifacts from his extensive career in the hope they are preserved for future generations. I thought it would be nice to keep some of this stuff so that the younger generation eventually there'd be samples of what their grandfathers and their great grandfathers used. Faust has become such a big fly fishing fixture in this valley. He's one of the only living people in Montana to have a plaque dedicated to them along a river. You know, I didn't know I was such a great guy until they did that. You know, I thought I was just one of the local fish bangers. I, you know, pretty humbling. He's about a four day drunk. And while Faust is modest, it is fair to say, at least in the Bitterroot Valley, he is a fly fishing legend. I'm Winston Greeley, at Among Montana's Fish, Wildlife and Parks.